what's, what's up, dude? Are oh, we good? back on the thing? We're, we're not back just yet, but we will be soon. All right, so, uh, all right, in three, two, one. Welcome to another episode of Atomic Pop featuring Fat Man and Little Boy. I'm Stephen Corka. I'm Juan Farage. This is part two of our weekly show, exclusive on YouTube, and we're here to talk about Kingsman, The Golden Circle. We finally saw this fucking movie. We finally did. We finally did. It only took us like a month. It was like when we saw Logan. Like, Logan came out, and it took us like it a month to watch so that movie. It took so long to watch it, yeah. And, and we waited longer than we should have, because that movie was great. Life. Um, and then Kingsman came out a couple weeks ago, and we finally saw it the other day, and... It was uh, terrible. It was Kingsman. No, it was not. Listen, I I liked it. I I, I thought it was bad. Why? Why? That's all you're gonna say? You gotta give me more than that. I'm, I'm letting you lead the conversation. No, you go ahead. You lead. All right. I don't know. I'm not gonna. Come on, lead. Um, you, love, you love to talk to the camera. Should I get up? No, 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 no. Okay. So what? If you want me to start talking about like yeah. nun porn. No, no, no. <laughs> so. <laughs> the th- if you watch the first Kingsman at the end of the movie there was this really like weird joke about her letting him sodomize her like giving you know anal yes right if you like that joke this whole movie is that joke Batsy is- just said yes. yes clearly we know what he likes in the sack right there he likes anal yeah clearly all those beads so yeah, he was like yes Yes. So the here and yes. my problem is, look, ladies, he's into it. Make it happen. So if you like um, the action, I'm not going to take away. Look, the action, the, the action scenes in the movie were fantastic. Fantastic. The the opening, the opening action scene, scene was, was like, amazing, dude. When the car like did that slide, like oh, that, yeah. just great. Yeah. So all the action scenes are By really way, spoilers, good. Spoilers, spoilers. Yeah, spoilers. All the action scenes are really, really, really good. Um. Once you're outside of the action scenes, it's just a really, it's overdone. It's too much, man. Here's what I thought. Like, I the mean, first one was kind of still grounded in reality. I mean, it's a movie, so whatever. Yes. But to the point, you know, this kid was poor. He lived. His his stepfather was abusive. Yes, yeah. This guy who his father saved recruits him. Yes. They go through that whole recruitment part, yes. part which none of it seemed... Right, the villain was what was really over the top. His plan was See, over the top. I didn't like Samuel Jackson in the first one. I thought I thought it was genius. Like for those of you that don't know, basically what Samuel Jackson did, the character he was playing was Russell Simmons. I, I still didn't yeah, like. It's him. like Russell Simmons, you know, like. But but anyways, so the only thing that was really over the top was the villain, um, and the villain's plans, which is a throwback to James Bond because in the James Bond movies, right? Yeah, yeah. Everything is grounded in reality with some fucking crazy shit, whether it be the car, his gadgets, or the villains are usually over the top. Yeah, yeah, of course. So this first, the first Kingsman really paid homage to it. This Kingsman just got rid of all the reality and said, we're going to exist in this world where like all this shit is happening and everyone else is normal. does not work for me. I thought... If you guys remember the first movie, that church scene, which was amazing. One of the best action scenes in any movie ever. It seemed like 90% of this movie was just, let's recreate that church scene yeah, for yeah. 90 minutes. Yeah. First of all, the movie was two and a half hours. Yes. Okay. It was they, long. They need to stop with these long ass movies. They were so Like, I love Blade Runner, so but like three long. hours of Blade Runner and two and a half hours of Kingsman, fuck. It's too long. It's yeah. not necessary. No. Like... Like sit in your editing room and make some cuts. Yeah. If you it, have have the DVD or download, be the longer director cut or whatever. But the theatrical release, a movie like Kingsman, 120 minutes max. Yeah, max. Like, they could have cut out that whole scene in the snow when they go get the antidote. They could have just made the antidote somewhere. Yeah, they it, didn't it even just, need to try to it, get the it, antidote. It, 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 so look, they they go to get this antidote and it breaks in that scene. And that's look, that means that. The whole point was to get the antidote, and it broke. You could just cut the whole fucking thing from the movie. It's like 40 minutes. It, there was so much yeah. fat that needed to be trimmed from this right. movie. The, the, spoiler, there's a cameo in there that would just un- should have just cut out the whole fucking thing. Who, Elton John? Yeah, I don't need 20 minutes of fucking Elton John, and I don't need Elton John doing a roundhouse kick. That was fucking weird. I know. I didn't mind Elton John. I thought that was funny. I thought that was good. Mm. I liked Elton John. Um, what what was the villain's name? What's her name? Poppy. No, what's her real name? Julianne Moore. Julianne Moore. I thought she was great. She was good, but they they didn't really give her a lot to do. No, they didn't. But but she was 
vicious in a wholesome way. I mean, that was a that was her like. Yeah, I I liked her better than Sam Jackson's villain. It yeah. You know. No, I I I prefer Sam Jackson. I didn't like Sam Jackson's villain. I was just like, oh god. But I don't know. The movie was just I don't I I didn't. The action was great. The Everything was else. Great. Yo, who's that girl that plays that one? Like she looks just like um. What's this girl from Election? Reese Witherspoon. Yeah, doesn't she? Who? The girl with the glasses. The, the other spy, yeah. Girl. Oh, she was hot. But she looks like a young Reese Witherspoon, yeah. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah she That's was, another thing, too. Like, I don't think she dies. She didn't come back, did she? No, she didn't come back yet. Well, every, uh, apparently no one dies in Kingsman because that yeah. guy... Got, Colin Firth. Colin Firth got shot in the head point blank. They even did a flashback they in tried to explain it and showed it. Like, I'm sorry. Like, bam, you're dead villain disappears and like 10 20 seconds later someone appears and saves your life with some pseudoscience no 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 i didn't like no it. no they needed to leave colin Firth no, dead they he didn't even need to be in the movie no he did not he didn't even because you want to know what the kid the, the the he was actually pointless in the movie the the, the the kid that was the new lead guy was great yeah he was he, he did was good. great he did we did not need colin Firth in the movie <laughs> they blew the fuck out of his dog. That shit's funny. Yeah, they did, yeah. <laughs> his fucking... But uh, <laughs> his girlfriend aged not well, by the way. The princess? <laughs> she looks terrible. Yeah, versus the, 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 the secret agent that was working with him. He said just ruined it for, for Batsy because he loves pugs. <laughs> yeah, they killed the pug. Bu- they, they, they killed the pug. They launched a missile at the dog. Yeah, Batsy has a pug. And <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. Yeah. yeah, man. So now here's the thing, man. If there's a third Kingsman, which I, there will be, will there be? Yeah, sure. Did it do well? Uh, I don't know, but oh. I, should, I should make a check real quick. Why? If, if they do make a third Kingsman, I will not watch it in theaters. Are you serious? Yeah, just like that. You're just, just, gonna, just. I'm just, done just with gonna, that. I'm done with it. You're gonna throw in the towel. I'm, yeah, I'm done with it, man. You didn't like it that much. The first one's one of my was one of my favorite movies of that year. I mean, a lot of it had to do with the strength of that church scene, and uh, and this one was just again. I appreciated the action was over the top, fantastic, but everything else I could do without. I mean, talk a little more while I look this up. Talk about what, man? I'm talk, done with everything. Talk, 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 talk. You want me to talk about Nunborn? No, no, keep talking about Kingsman. My favorite type right, of go, porn. Here we, go, here, we go, here we go. Look, listen. I like, King, I, stop, like what do stop, they call when people stop, are missing limbs? Stop, stop. <laughs> All right. Kingsman, Kingsman has made, <laughs> Kingsman has made $90 million. Okay. It, it cost 104 to make. But $90 million Domestic. domestically. Okay. Yeah. So they're going to make their money back. Enough to, to do number three? How much did it make internationally? I don't fucking know, dude. Why are you making me look? Um, if if they make a, if they make the money, they'll make another one. Listen, check this out. You know what they're making? It has made three hundred and fifteen million domestically. Wow. It cost thirty five to make. Yeah, wow. Like wow. You know what? All that tells me that they're not going to make a third Blade Runner. No, Blade Runner. <laughs> Blade Runner total. Has done sixty million. Wow, and it costs like one hundred and fifty. One hundred and fifty. It only it only took him fifteen last week. Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's because Blade. That's Runner really that sad. It One of the best good. sci-fi movies of all time. It wasn't that good at all. Anyways, um, but so <clears throat> we we agree the action was great. We agree Colin Firth was not necessary. We agree we agree that Julia Moore was entertaining to watch at times. Right. We don't agree on Elton John. I liked Elton John in the movie. You didn't. I did not. Um, Uh, The last major thing is I was hugely disappointed by the Statesman. I was disappointed by the Statesman, too. Now, if... The Statesman is the U.S. response to the Kingsmen. Right. And the Kingsmen are tailors. The Statesmen are... Producers of whiskey. Producers of whiskey, exactly. Fine. But uh, if maybe they wouldn't have taken him out in the beginning where... I thought he was going to have a bigger role. Uh, We're talking about um, what's his name? What's what's the guy's name? The the guy, the the buff guy, Channing yeah, Tatum. T- of course, Patsy knew his name. 
Yeah. If Channing Tatum if was... Channing the, T- they took Channing Tatum out like... In like, the movie, right. Like, almost right away. They didn't kill him. They just made him not in the movie. Yeah. They, right? they, they, he, he OD'd and, and he was in a coma. For yeah, so movie. I feel like I was kind of bamboozled there. Yeah, totally. Because because of the previews, it seems it's like Channing the Tatum. So and instead, the, uh, and instead we got the other guy that, that I I just oh he was not charismatic. I was just not who's into that guy. Him. That guy's been in some other shit. I don't. I didn't really care to look, man. And I didn't like his weapon. Like so, you know how like the whip. Yeah, I didn't like the whip. I think the what they did no, with the, the whip was cool. No, but action wise, whip I, and the lasso. Yeah, the, and they it turns like electrical. And no, I just no. Nah, it's, I, I, I didn't like it. the statesman. Oh, and and Jeff Bridges was just weird, champ. It was just. It was Jeff, all n- unnecessary. I thought it was bad. The only thing I liked looked, was Halle Berry. It, it was American cowboy stereotypes right. for days. Yeah, yeah. That's what the statesmen were. I mean, the Kingsmen are stereotypes too, but I didn't feel like it was played out as much. Halle Berry wasn't good. You know and, what? First of all, she seemed timid. Yeah. Uh, like a tim- the, the nerd. You know, like where the other right. guy. Who's, who's, who's the guy from Kingsmen? Merlin. Merlin is way amazing. more charismatic. Yeah. Like, like, carry scenes on his own, great. Yeah. Halle Berry just did not, was not an equal to no. Merlin. And, and bec- you know what it was weird is because, so you had all these people playing these exaggerated versions of, like, these cowboys. Yes. Right? And then Halle Berry is not. Not even close to a cowboy. Nothing. So it's like, it, it, yeah. it's weird. It just and feels then, wrong. at mm. the end of the movie, they make her one of the agents, like one of the lead agents. It's like. not going to work. And it's like... Because when they did in the Kingsman with uh, the Drew <laughs> with the uh, Reese Witherspoon look like it made sense and it felt yes right yeah doesn't with Halle Berry so I think they botched the whole Statesman thing. Um, Channing Tatum was fantastic though fantastic. in the scenes he was in. Yeah, he's great. Fantastic. Why did they didn't give him more screen time? Maybe it wasn't know. in their budget. Maybe he cost more money than that. I don't know. But he but, was yeah. He was he was great. You know. So my opinion is that you should not. Go see the Kingsman. Save your money. Watch it at home. Kingsman, Golden Circle. It's been out in theaters for almost a month now, give or take. Uh, it'll be in them for a little bit more, and then it's going to video. Yeah. Or the internet. Whatever. You can't even call it video anymore. What do you call it when it leaves the theaters? Where does it go? To the web? To the world. <laughs> and it goes to digital. digital. There we go. Digital. Thank you, Batsy. Yeah. Why does he make fart noises all the time? It's called raspberries. It's really weird. You know that? What, when you make noises? when you make that fart sound with your mouth, it's called blowing raspberries. So making a fart noise with your mouth is called a raspberry? Yeah. Why is that? I don't fucking know. So that's, like, that's fucking stupid. I ask your people. Like, get a council together. I don't fucking know what to tell you. Wait, I'm, that, that's, a, I, that's a white thing? Hell yeah. What, do you think? There's no raspberries in Cuba. What are you saying? Hispanics are restricted to the territory of Cuba. Well, no, we make we make fart noises, but we call them fucking bales. We call them farts, man. Like you guys are naming your shit after fruits. I don't know. Look, I just I call it what it is. It's a fart. I didn't call it a raspberry. Yeah. Uh, well, there you go. Look. So what we've learned today, besides Kingsman is okay, was that raspberries was created by white people to, to for fart noises. Rich likes anal. And uh, and. and not Rich, I'm sorry, he used his real name. Batsy likes anal. Mm-hmm. <laughs> his last initial starts with the letter T, isn't Tom? <laughs> Look him up. He's, he's pre- he likes penguins, too. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know what I was thinking? Tell me. Because we do like call like the vagina like after fruits in Spanish. Yeah, and like other well, we things, call, we, we call it peach. it's like the forbidden, forbidden fruit thing. Well, because you know the peach, peach kind of looks peachy. Well, the nice ones do. Although, although the peach emoji is an ass. You want to rank? What are we ranking? Huh? Best looking vaginas. Uh, we can't do that. Do All mean? right. No, we can't do that. Sci-fi. Wait, 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 wait. This concludes part two oh. of of our weekly episode. Um, uh, on our YouTube channel. In addition to this, we will be posting up another posting for. Top 10 science fiction movies ever to date. That's the big one. We're excited about that one. You're doing this just to troll me. <laughs> no, I know your list is going to be terrible. My list is going to be amazing. Oh, my list is amazing. Here it is. All right. Yeah. Are you going to cut it off? I'm going to cut it off and start it over again. You don't want me to talk about things to no, the camera? Yeah. Nun porn is awesome. <laughs>